When will Kronos get that big move to the upside that we have literally all been waiting for? Welcome back to the channel D Web Guide Community. It is your host Jordan. We're going to be diving down into the charts. We're going to be diving down into the price action. You guys really need to see what I am seeing because it is important. All right. So getting into coin market cap, you guys will see that yes, we are down today at about five to six percent. Whenever it comes to our rank, we're at 23. And if I'm correct, I believe we have given up a few spots, which is not something we really want to see, right? So market cap, a little bit under 3 billion in the volume. It is down today at about 23%. Now, if we take a look over the past month on Kronos, Technically, it's been uh, kind of steady, I guess I should say. We're hovering around 13, had a nasty drop, right back up at 13, nasty drop all the way up to 14, and now we're a little bit below 12. Now, if we take a look on the three month, you guys will see that the overall trend Technically, it's just been coming to the downside. We haven't had any bullish signs of a big move back up here, technically to around 18 cents, which played as a strong support, which will most likely play as a strong resistance, right? So if we take a look over here on the right side, a lot of people are bullish, but there's also a lot of people who are bearish whenever it comes to Kronos. So kind of curious uh, to see what's going to happen here, because this is actually one that I think is going to do very well in the future. So if we go ahead and dive down into the charts, please keep in mind, you guys, that this is not financial advice. That means that you need to do your own due diligence and you need to do your own research. So the last time that we talked about Kronos, we stated that we had to get this uh, breakout, right? We have this nasty sloping resistance right here so it's going to be very very important let's actually change this a different color it's going to be very very important that we keep eyes on the sloping resistance not only that but you guys can see on a four hour time frame right we have the 200 ema and we're kind of just flirting with that when the price is above it it is bullish when the price is below it it is considered bearish and you guys can see that we've been uh technically below the uh, 200 EMA for uh, quite a while, technically since like 50 cents. <laughs> so uh, it's been a minute. So anyways, Kronos, you guys, nasty sloping resistance, got rejected over here multiple times, got rejected here. We got to get that breakout, you guys. Very, very important. If we can get that breakout, uh, technically we're looking for like 14 cents. That's literally what we need. We need to break out of this sloping resistance, 14 cents, and back above the 200 EMA. And once that happens, then we have a great opportunity to become short-term bullish. You're probably thinking, why short-term bullish? Well, if we take a look here, ladies and gentlemen, whenever it comes to Kronos, we still have a massive, and I mean a massive sloping resistance that is way out here. And it's probably going to take many, many months for us to even touch that line. So if we can get that breakout of this short-term sloping resistance, then we have a great opportunity to run up to this sloping resistance to backtest our long-term sloping resistance that technically has been causing the price action to dump like crazy, right? So in our previous videos, we did state for Kronos that uh, we're looking for a bottom here. We're looking for a bottom in this purple box, all right? So we have a purple box. There should be a lot of support here. Okay, there should be a lot of support here, and you guys can clearly see that. A lot of support over here, a lot of support here. So I'm looking for anywhere. Obviously, we're right below 12 cents, but I'm going to be looking for a lot of support. Technically, it should be right around 11 cents all the way to about uh, 9 cents. We should have some strong support there. Very, very strong support, and that should actually be our bottom. If anything, I'm hoping we're at a bottom now, but it's not looking... Uh, so good yet at this current moment so i don't think we're currently out of the wind or out of the storm yet i think uh, we just got to be patient to see what happens but still this could be a great opportunity as stated not financial advice but it could be a great opportunity to average down right not only that could be a great opportunity for a potential long-term entry so if you get in now only put in a little bit and then obviously in a few months once we start to head into a full bull run i hope it's in a few months then i would start to add to your overall position while we start to look good Good because right now, as stated, we're in a massive, massive bear market, right? Nasty sloping resistance, nasty sloping resistance. Uh, Chrono's overall chart just, it really doesn't look good. Got to be honest with you guys. Really doesn't look good, okay? So uh, it kind of just looks like a massive uh, pump and dump, to be honest with you. Like over here, massive pump and dump, but here it created higher lows, right? So I was expecting Chrono's to hold a strong support here, but it didn't, right? So I'm hoping... Uh, Kronos can eventually uh, hold on strong. That is what I would like to see. I'd like to see it hold on to these levels. Then eventually I'd like to see us get a uh, continuation to the upside. So this is what I still believe in. And I just can't say it enough, you guys. With it being number 23 on CoinMarketCap, right? Number 23 
almost a billion dollars in market cap. I mean, this tells us that obviously it's got a lot of attention. A lot of people like this and a lot of people believe in it. And I would say that I do as well. All right. So ladies and gents, if you don't know who I am, my name is Jordan. I'm with the web guy community. 100% free. Check out our discord. Going to be posting crypto setups along with a chart request. So if you have any cryptos you'd like me to take a look at, just join and ask and I'll post a chart. We also have a directory. We got NFTs, we got insights, we got news, and we got referral codes. We even have a lot of articles to the downside. So if you guys would like to, you can check out one of these articles. Only takes a few minutes to read. I mean, me personally, I enjoy them. Uh, they're great to read. I like it stated just really, really quick and just go through all the information. Okay. Now, if you're looking for the referral codes or discounts, Click right up here. We do have a lot of them. Got to let you know we got crypto.com. We got to BlockFi. We got Binance. A lot of them. Okay. So just go sign up. Use our refer codes, you guys. It's easy and simple. For example, crypto.com. All you have to do, ladies and gents, is just click right here. And you got to stake, if I'm correct, about $600 worth of uh, Kronos. That's it. And you're going to get a payout. All right. So as stated, not financial advice. As far as I know, my details are correct here, but I uh, just want to be transparent for you so you guys can check all of this out. All right. So ladies and gents, let us know. What do you think about Kronos? Are you bullish? Are you bearish? Especially for the long term. Have a great one. We'll see you later and ciao.